The announcement of Sam Basil and his members' move was made in Port Mosby yesterday, welcomed by Prime Minister Peter O'Neill and his People's National Congress Party. Their move now leaves only six Pangu Party members in the opposition. Mosby Northwest MP Sam Makere Morauta was among those that left behind, including Dr. Lino Tom, Wabek Open, Seki Agisa, Southfly Open, Brian Kramer, Medeng Open, Renbo Paita, Finchafen Open, and Connie Iguan, Makam Open. Sam Makere, in an interview with NBC National News today, expressed a dissatisfaction in the move by Mr. Basil and his Pangu parliamentary wing. I'm disappointed, but I also know uh, that uh, its leader has a right to make decisions, so I respect the decision. So when I respect the decision, I am disappointed. He clarified that there were no discussion by the parliamentary caucus regarding this, but he is sure the move could be to have easy access to services improvement program funds. Sam Mekere, however, urged the leaders from both sides to put the interest of the nation first. <coughs> that only will come in the last five years have destroyed the institutions of state, have grown the culture of corruption, have interfered with law and order enforcement agencies, mismanaged the public finances of the country. And when leaders move to his side, they're really condoning that very practice giving him the strength and confidence to continue to destroy the institutions and the future of the country. Meanwhile, he says the opposition is still intact. We now have to put that aside, regroup, and start the journey again. Uh, the journey is to put good government, government that understands people's needs, government that's a heart for the people, not government that fills his own pocket. Sheila Malkin, NBC National.